What is up guys, Anthony here with Setup Productions 115 and yes, new iPhones, iPods and all that fun stuff have been released today and it's gonna be awesome. Alright, so the first thing I wanted to talk about is the iPod Touch and the iPod Touch, i just amazed. Uh, I can't believe they added colors for it. They added colors. Okay, so the iPod Touch got better cameras, 5 megapixel camera on the back. Uh, I think the same camera as the iPhone 4S, probably? Not the, I mean the iPhone 4. Um, that and Siri and the front facing camera is 720p HD. So that is awesome. I think I'm 30 frames per second as well. It's the thinnest iPod they've ever made. And I'm just astounded on how Apple keeps making their products more and more light. It's just crazy. Uh, the next one's the Nano. The Nano, the Nano looks, uh, the Nano looks, uh, I have no words for the Nano. I'm not saying the Nano is looks bad. It looks pretty awesome. But I think this is the design they're probably going to stick with. Because uh, it just looks reasonable uh, and stuff like that. So yeah, that's the new Nano. The new Nano looks pretty pretty cool. I'm like, it looks really really futuristic. Like, I just don't know. Apple always does that, you know, with their futuristic stuff. Um. So yeah, some of the features it has a 2.5 inch multi-touch display, a very small home screen button, and I'll get more into the to the to the features of every thing like the iPod, the iPhone, and the Nano in a later video probably this weekend just so I can like get all the information together and yeah oh what the fuck oh uh, yeah that's 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 so um that and now last but not least the iPhone 5 yes the iPhone 5 um it looked exactly exactly how it was gonna look from all the rumors, from all the pictures, from all everything, it looks exactly so. I, I guess you already saw it before it actually was announced, you know. Um, but uh, let's see some facts about it real quick. Um, bigger screen, uh, new size, uh, 4G slash LTE, of course. Uh, a6 processor, not a, a not a A5X processor like the iPhone 4S had. Um, FaceTime works over cellular, of course, they, that's going to be an iOS 6 for every iPhone, probably. Um, still, like, the colors, like, black, and it's going to be, like, a little black announced, like, not, not announced, like, a little black on the back. I don't know how to say that. It's like a matte finish, I think, probably. Um, new dock connector, iOS 6, and Siri. Oh, Siri can now launch apps. It's about fucking time. Uh, let's see what else, let's see what else. Battery life, 8 hours of talk time. On 3G, it's not that impressive. 8 hours of web browsing on LTE, okay, that's kind of impressive. 10 hours video, um, sure. 40 hours of music, um, okay, okay, well, I guess. And pre-orders for the iPhone 5 start this Friday, the 14th. So, this looks promising, and they honestly, they, they've made the iPhone 5 way thinner than it than it, than the iPhone 4s which I think well I mean I would I thought that was impossible cuz I didn't know they can make such a thin a thin device more thin and it's crazy but um yeah so the carriers it will be launching on will be AT&T Verizon and Sprint and it's a world phone so anywhere in the world that has LTE you can use it yes uh near um, NFC hasn't been announced yet, so yeah, we'll probably see that in the Friday video. Um, but yeah, that was just a quick overview of all the stuff they announced today at um, uh, the the conference, the Apple's conference. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching the video. Like this, share it so people can see this. And um, yeah, thanks, guys. I'll talk to you guys later.